Around one in four of all crashes is the front into rear crash. Where the driver is distracted, this leads to thousands of whiplash claims every single year. But new technologies can address this by automatically monitoring the traffic situation and if needs be, braking for the driver to avoid a collision like that. Let's see how it works. These four vehicles are all fitted with Autonomous Emergency Braking or AEB systems. New technologies increasingly being fitted to our vehicles that could substantially reduce the incidence of being killed or seriously injured on European roads. AEB sensors are fitted to the vehicle either behind the windscreen or at the front of the vehicle and they're lasers for low speed for city or their radars and cameras for the higher speed interurban system. They're designed to work when maybe the driver isn't and they can brake for the driver if he doesn't to avoid the crash occurring in the first place. These two vehicles are fitted with city-based systems. In our towns and cities, the most common injury tends to be whiplash. Very rarely life-threatening, but it is a serious injury. These two vehicles have a solution. They're fitted with a LiDAR. These systems use lasers shining six metres ahead of the vehicle. And when there's a reflection, the system will automatically break to prevent the collision. The XC60 here is very important because this was the first vehicle fitted with an AEB city system. Real world data suggests that this is actually reducing crashes by about 25% with a resulting reduction in whiplash injuries. These two vehicles are fitted with more sophisticated technology. These have interurban systems. Interurban systems are more complex and they use radars and sometimes cameras in sensor fusion to constantly monitor the traffic situation around the vehicle. If there's a potential collision uh, ahead, the system will warn the driver so the driver can react. If the driver doesn't react, then the system can take over and automatically brake to avoid the collision occurring. The interurban tests use a mobile barrow towed behind an SUV. This represents crashes on faster roads like motorways where we see more killed and seriously injured. Here, the driver can either react to a warning or the vehicle will automatically brake to avoid the collision occurring. This vehicle, this Mercedes, has perhaps the most sophisticated system here because it combines both radars here and here and a stereo camera system. So this system is more sophisticated and can identify more potential collision threats and avoid more crashes. We're going to increasingly see this technology being fitted to vehicles in the future. There are tens of thousands of pedestrians and cyclists killed and seriously injured on European roads annually. But AAB systems can address these as well. Fusing the radar with cameras, these systems will protect adults and children from some of the most distressing crashes of all. Since 2012, the British insurers have been incentivising vehicle manufacturers to fit standard AEB systems by assessing them in the group rating system. So a vehicle like this gets around a four group reduction, which means its owner gets meaningful savings on their annual insurance premium.
AEB represents a major step forward for vehicle safety and it's already leading to significant reductions in whiplash injuries. Thatcham, on behalf of the UK insurers, will continue to test and evaluate these systems and encourage their wider fitment to make the UK roads a safer place.